Hello, golf friends. Should you hit an organic or inorganic draw? We're going to talk about that today on Tour Swing Tuesday. Hi, this is Gary Bates from the Gary Bates Golf Academy. I'm a PGA teaching professional and certified V1 video analysis coach. So I was watching an instructional video the other day, and the gentleman was saying the best way to draw it is to take the club back shut, in other words, facing the ground more, and then the downswing, make sure you release your left hand over uh, through impact. And I thought, gosh, that's a very complicated way to do it. I think it's a much easier way. I want to talk to you about that today on Tour Swing Tuesday. So up here we have Brandon Grace, very fine player, won in Puerto Rico last year, ranked 68th in the world from South Africa. One of those guys that you just wait to stumble onto a major victory as he has a penchant for playing well in the majors. Okay, taking into motion right here. So I really like his setup, close to the ball there, right? So Closer than some, but that's just fine to me. Now, I want to show you this position right here as he takes it back. Um, he's going to let the club open a lot. So, you know, here's uh, my beef a little bit with uh, that video is you just don't see guys on tour, gals on tour, take the back shot. And the reason is because when you do that, you're going to have a much easier chance to hit it low left. And the opening and closing of the club face gives you some power and some height. So I would much prefer you to be here. now. What are going to be the factors in your club opening a lot? Your grip. So I want you to check out last week's video. I think it'll help you a ton. On Doc Redman, he has a very strong grip. To me, that's organic. You Instead of creating something, right, like a shut face, you allow it to happen by strengthening your left-hand grip and your grip in general. Okay? So taking it back here now. Now he's going to get the club a little more upright, you know, in front of him a lot. So he doesn't get the club very deep, interlock grip right there, hinging fine, head in position, all that's really good. But when you look at him here, this is a little bit unusual. Don't see this with a lot of tour players. It's not very deep. In other words, if you draw that butt end of the club down to the ground, it's off maybe, you know, the middle of his foot instead of on his heel. Um, and an open club face here. So how's he going to get the club face squared? Combination of rotation, his body, and his arms. Okay, super. So now he's going to just drop that club right down, and he's going to get it flattening, right? This is the key move that if you want to draw the ball, club face close the path, right? So you swing out to the right, strengthen your grip. That's a simple, organic way <laughs> to draw the ball, folks. Okay, coming down, look at that, right on plane, right? So that original shaft line plane is where we want to be right here. That's where you see everybody. So whether you kind of go in onto the plane or up onto the plane, as long as you get on that plane, you don't miss the plane, <laughs> you'll be good. Okay, into impact right here. Excellent strike. Look at that ball divot. Look at that shaft realign, right? Look at his backside against that line. Look at his head in position. So I, I think this guy, watch out from the majors. He might get one this year. All right. Into the follow through. Look at that excellent divot. Folks, that's what you want to do. I got some drills I can help you with. If you don't know how to take that divot, divot and extending right into the follow through. Oh, this is beautiful. Not a lot of face rotation. And up onto the right toe. So that's Brandon Grace, fine player from South Africa. Um, as you look at him, you just see a lot of great positions. And looking at that setup, that's one of them. Okay. So thanks for being with us. Hey, we love having you along. If you're a new subscriber, well, welcome. We love having you a part of the community. If you haven't subscribed yet, yeah, hit the subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up. Let us know that you like the videos and that they help you. I hope they help you. That's why we do them every week. And we wish you a very great year this year. You know, hey, this is a time to a couple things. One, send your video in to me. I can analyze it and send it back with uh, some voiceover. Very easy to do with the V1 app. And the other thing I would say is get out and get some lessons. This is the time to do it in the off season. You work on your swing. That's my mini tip for the day. So thank you for being with us. Anything you need, don't hesitate to reach out. And we'll look forward to seeing you next time on Tour Swing Tuesday. Take care and bye for now.